Welcome to the Salem vlog. We spent one full day in Salem. This is our second visit and got up to a lot of fun things in the witchy city and headed out to some of the Hocus Pocus filming locations as well. We started off at Gallows Hill Museum Theatre at the Witch Dungeon Museum and then headed over to the Witch House which is very directly in the middle of the city but looks very very spooky and is it open for tourists. At the back entrance you'll find the gift shop and where you can buy tickets to go and explore the house and it has some very nice little knickknacks and books on the Salem Witch Trials and a lot of different information about the Salem Witch Trials, really cool things that you can bring home and purchase. Then we headed into the Salem Witch City with a lot of different stores and boutiques. This is an old bank that has been transformed into a retail store and this is the Bewitched statue as Bewitched was set in Salem. And then this is the main high street which you have a lot of shops, a lot of spooky shops with different costumes, clothes, a wicked book store and they sell lots of things on tarot reading, hocus pocus spell books, wicca, all the witchy stuff you could ever want, you'll find it in here. You'll find a lot of witch themed shops on this main street. There are tours as well if you want to have a walking tour or a guided tour through the city and the history. But a really cool spot to come and see and just collect all of your little merchandise here. A replica of the Hocus Pocus book and Billy Butcherson's gravesite. And this is the Salem Witch Museum. So the first time we came here, we did come here and I would definitely recommend it. They have a reenactment of the Salem Witch Trials and talk you through what happened in the history. And then we headed out on a little drive because we had a car with us this time around so we could see a lot more of Salem. And which is quite surprising, it is set on the water, which because it is in Massachusetts, but really good water views, which you don't really kind of relate to Salem. But this is the House of the Seven Gables, a very famous place in Salem and it was $30 per ticket to go in and see it so we didn't end up paying it. It was a bit expensive for us but you can kind of see from the outside a very lovely view of the water as well but this is one of the most famous and oldest mansions in the Salem, Massachusetts area. Then another funky witchy shop to come and visit and then we headed off to see the Hocus Pocus filming locations. First up is Max and Danny's house, which is a very famous and recognisable spot. But from the movie, you will not see that there is water. You will have no idea that it's set here, which is very, very cool. But this is someone's private house. And this is Alison's house, so this is more of a museum. So you can come here, have a wander around. There are open gardens, but this is Alison's house. They come and visit and grab some sweets. And uh, you can wander around the gardens at the back. You can also go into the house, I believe. But yeah, it's a really cool mansion and a lot to learn here too. And then this is the town hall. So this is where the famous, the parents do the dance routine and where the sisters saying, I put a spell on you. Just from the outside, the inside was actually set somewhere else, but this is the outside of the building. And then we went on to the Pioneer Village, so this is where all the opening scenes and like Thackeray Binks and the way back when film part was set and the Sanderson sisters as well. So really, really cool. Thanks so much for watching and check out my full Boston and Salem vlog linked here.